Check this kit out, fellas. This is sick. What we have here is a Texas Chainsaw Massacre. This is the video game 8-bit version uh, by NECA Toys, Real Toys. Um, I've been eyeing this up for a long time, guys. Um, I, I just haven't gotten it for the longest time because uh, I had other things on my wish list that I wanted before this. But this has always been... For about a year now, something that I've been, you know, checking out, coming back and forth to, and then finally I just decided to uh, to, to grab it. But um, so this box is actually uh, meant to house the figure and keep the figure in without um, removing it. Um, there's the uh, eight bit um, leather face on the back there. I'll read this to you real quick. Put aside your childish pastime. Stop eating dots and chasing ghosts. A rippling, uh, revving chainsaw is at your command as you wear the leather mask of a madman. Your victims come face to face with the living nightmare as you wield the ultimate weapon on unrelentless chainsaw. Uh, let your most wicked fancies go wild. Know the total pleasures of destruction as you pursue your victims with the razor-sharp teeth of a hungry chainsaw. The story is true. The movie is chilling. The action figure is horrifying. Okay, that's what it says on the back of the box here. Um, I never played the video game. Um, looks pretty decent, though. But anyway, back to the um, figure here. So it's meant to stay in the box, and I'll, and I'll show you why, and I'll, I'll you know show you how. It's got this nifty little flip-open front with a piece of Velcro on either side to keep it closed. Um, but um, if you want to display it in your collection like this, you know, keep it in the box. It's you know you can open it, you can display it like this. Um, it's pretty pretty cool. It's got like the fuel, I guess, for the chainsaw. I'm guessing um, as much fuel as you have. Um, you, I, I'm guessing you you're running around as Leatherface, and you know you can you know kill the people as long as you have enough fuel in your chainsaw. I'm guessing. I've never played the game. Um, on the left here, it says the Ch Texas Chainsaw Massacre and that old uh, computer script typing. Um, and it's got a thousand down at the bottom. Um, you can see he's wearing, you know, he's all green, 8-bit style. Got his green chainsaw on the right. He's pretty basic. Uh, just a cool piece, guys. Um, I actually, I'm going to definitely keep the box for this. But I, I think I might take him out to display him on a shelf with the other Leatherface figures. But I will open up the box carefully and keep the box. Because I do kind of want to keep it displayed in the box. But the box takes up so much damn room, guys. I don't have all this room to be putting this you know stuff out like this. So I think I'm going to take him out, display him, and save the box. Put the box aside somewhere. Um, I like the box a lot, so that's why I'm keeping it. Um, and then who knows, maybe down the road I'll want to display it inside the box like this. I don't know. So I'm going to just take them out, put them up on the shelf with the other leather face action figures. And then down the road, I'll pop them back in here if need be. I'll keep it, uh, keep the box in good condition here. All right, guys, there you have it. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention, check out the badass artwork on the cover. That's just sick, guys. You know, that's just a cool-ass artwork for an action figure. Yeah. All right, that's all I have for you. I'll go down to the horror cave and see if I can find anything else to show you guys today. I feel like I'm on a roll with this video stuff, so I'll go down and I'll see if I have anything else laying around that I can you know, turn into a video. All right, guys.
We'll see you.